Geography is really interesting and engaging. It's everything. If you read the news, almost everything is linked to our subject, but the skills that we teach them, the um, description and analysis and evaluation, all those skills, they're massively valued by employers. It's all about looking at how we live now and why that's not sustainable and what we can do about it. So virtually every industry in the world is dealing with that problem and our students are dealing with that on a smaller scale but they're dealing with that in almost every lesson. It is hugely important and I feel really lucky that I get to teach something that is that dynamic and that relevant. We start off in year seven quite straightforwardly looking at the UK and the different features in the UK and where the cities are and why they're there. So we do kind of an introduction that covers stuff they might know but things that they probably should know. Um, and then they start to get a handle on quite a few different topics that way so they get a taste of the human side, the physical side and a little bit of the environmental. And they start to see how it connects to other subjects. And then we go into a bit more physical so we do volcanoes, we do um, land use, we do a big topic on weather sort of as we come into spring, it's all about trying to develop a lifelong love of learning. We follow that through year eight, year nine. We cover the idea that we're trying to give stuff that is applicable to them and that they see going on in the world. So year eight, we do far more about um, like human processes. So we're looking at the minute in year eight, they're looking at industry and how our manufacturing industry has declined, but other industries have taken up. We go from there to look at manufacturing in Asia and China and how that's helped the country to develop. And then we look at Africa and how that's changing really rapidly. And then year nine is a big topic, so climate change and pollution and resources and ecosystems. So we'd make it topics that are gonna engage them and that they will have opinions on. We want them to have views on these topics. We don't want them to be passive audiences. We want them to be engaged and enthused and have opinions.